Emmanuel, Matthew 1.23. Behold, a virgin shall be with child, and bear a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, meaning the God with us. Jesus Christ to empowers his followers to change the world today. Distance is not a barrier to God's move. Emmanuel TV, God with us. Give that shout, hallelujah. All right, I believe we're ready to listen to this next testimony. Uh, so you're very welcome here to the Synagogue Church of All Nations. Please introduce yourself, your name, where you're from, and your testimony. Emmanuel. Emmanuel. I'm Mrs. Savoy Irene Muyundachiteta. I'm from Zambia. My testimony goes like this. I was in this auditorium last year, February, the arena of liberty. Before I came in this place, I was facing a lot of challenges. I was going through pay a painful life. I was going through a painful life. I was crying every day. But when I came in this place, I got a lot of breakthroughs in my life. So can you explain to us a little bit more about uh, the challenges you were facing in, in your life, uh, in your relationship with your, with your husband in different areas? Can you explain to us those challenges in a bit more detail so people can understand? My life was full of limitation, quarreling all the time with my husband. Okay, and uh, can you share with us what happened when you came here to the Synagogue Church of All Nations? When I came here, I received my anointing water and I received a touch from the wise man. When I went back home, my first testimony, it was miracle, an instant testimony of my husband. This is my husband who was a chain smoker for 18 years. When he made it start anointing water, instantly he stopped smoking. From 7 February last year to this date, he has never smoked again. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. Husband was smoking, chain smoking for 18 years after ministering the anointing water to him. He's completely stopped smoking. Can we listen to more testimonies? The next one was this one of this house. First of all, when I came here, we were living in this house. It was in a remote area. So I wasn't, we were not really comfortable with this. And we were trying to sell it all along, but to no avail. So when we, I came back from here, ministered ourselves with the anointing water. Instantly we found a customer. We sold this house and God blessed us with this house, which is behind American Embassy. It is a prime area right now in Lusaka. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. You can see the land there that she, uh, her and her husband really wanted this particular plot of land and this house. And after ministering the anointing water, they were able to get the land. And that's the new house that they're now staying in. And uh, what other testimonies do you have? The third one was this one of a farmland. We still went ahead to apply for a farmland with the Minister of Lands. And within no time, the Minister of Land called us that they have offered us with a farmland for agricultural purposes. And it is a four hectare farmland. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ. We also applied for a farmland and it was granted as well. We thank God Almighty for your life. Once again, can you share with us what were the challenges you were having in your career? Uh, before you received the uh, farmland there, what challenges were you going through before getting the land? My career was so devastating because I found myself in a place where I did not study. I started accounts, but I was in a place where I did not start accounts. But when I came here, after ministering my anointing water, I applied and I was put in a place where I'm supposed to be. I'm now in the accounts department. To God with the glory. And after ministering the anointing water, you've been able to discover your real value. And uh, can you share with us, how did you minister the anointing water? What was the prayer that you prayed? I just prayed to say that, Lord Jesus, you've paid for all my humiliations. You've paid for all my limitation in my life. 
I claim what is mine in Jesus' name. That was all. And you received all these incredible breakthroughs. In all these breakthroughs. Let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ once again. You see, our whole life has been transformed uh, through the anointing water. Her husband has been delivered from 18 years of uh, chain smoking. They've got their dream house, the house that they wanted, and also the farmland of which uh, should now be using for agricultural purposes. We thank God Almighty for your life. Can you share with us what is your advice for the world? Before I can share my advice, I want to use this opportunity to thank the man of God who has availed himself to be a tool in the hands of God to deliver this world in the name of Jesus Christ. My prayer is that the Almighty God will increase his strength from strength as he's reaching out the whole world to take out the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. What's your advice? My advice is this anointing water represents the Holy Spirit. When you see this anointing water, believe in your heart that you've seen the Holy Spirit who fights all your battles in your life. Wonderful advice, Sam. We want to encourage you as well to make God's Word the standard for your life. Continue to involve yourself, participate in uh, God's projects, and we know better is not good enough. The best is yet to come for you in Jesus' name. Amen. Mesdames et messieurs, nous sommes en train d'écouter ce merveilleux témoignage de cette dame qui nous vient de la Zambie. Elle nous dit qu'elle faisait face à beaucoup de difficultés dans sa vie et qu'elle faisait face à de la limitation dans tout ce qu'elle entreprenait et avait des problèmes avec son mari. Et pour la gloire de Dieu, elle arriva finalement à la synagogue église de toutes les nations l'an dernier et a eu l'opportunité de recevoir l'audition et la prière des hommes sages. Elle nous dit que depuis ce jour, sa vie a complètement changé. Elle est rentrée chez elle et a administré l'audition à son mari qui était fumeur, il était dépendant à la cigarette pendant 18 ans. Et juste après qu'elle a administré l'audition à ce dernier, il a instantanément arrêté de fumer depuis l'année dernière jusqu'à maintenant. Plus une seule, un seul bâton de cigarette dans sa bouche. Il rend toute la gloire à Dieu pour ça. Et c'est pas tout. Elle a eu aussi... Euh à vivre dans une maison qui était très reculée de la ville, ce qui euh, ne la mettait pas du tout en sécurité. Et pour la gloire de Dieu, à travers l'audition, elle a pu vendre cette maison et son mari et elle ont pu construire une nouvelle maison en plein centre-ville, juste derrière l'ambassade des états unis à Lusaka, en Zambie. Elle nous dit aussi qu'elle a eu aussi l'opportunité de pouvoir s'acquérir une grande ferme de plusieurs hectares et qu'elle a eu aussi à avoir euh, une promotion dans son travail comme... Euh, euh, comptable dans, dans une banque. Elle est ici pour rendre toute la gloire à Dieu et remercier le Seigneur pour tout ce qu'il a fait pour elle à travers le moyen de l'eau d'onction. Ils sont autour de vous. Vous êtes bien priés de vous bien vouloir vous adresser aux huissiers car Dieu utilise ce moyen pour pouvoir apporter la bénédiction, apporter le bonheur, apporter la guérison, la délivrance et toutes ces bénédictions dans votre vie au nom de Jésus-Christ. Il nous suffit juste de croire, d'ouvrir notre cœur au Seigneur afin que ce dernier puisse opérer des transformations radicales dans notre vie et nous ouvrir les portes du bonheur au nom de Jésus-Christ. If you would like to visit the Synagogue Church of All Nations, log on to our website www.goan.org. Go to the Visit Us page, and for those from within Nigeria, you can call the three visit lines that appear on the website. For those from outside Nigeria, there are some frequently asked questions that will assist you in your visit procedure. Remember, it is essential that anyone from outside Nigeria should fill in the questionnaire. Please remember to answer every question that is asked. And after you have filled in the questionnaire, remember to click Send. Please note, you must wait to receive an invitation or confirmation of your visit from us before making any traveling arrangements or flight bookings. All communication with the Synagogue Church of All Nations should be through the following email address. Info at scoan.org We look forward to hearing from you. Emmanuel, God with us.